All right, back in season four. Kind of an impromptu episode. Wasn't going to do one tonight, but uh, jumped in to do it. And as you can see, I'm at the bottom of one of my my mining holes. I was grabbing some stuff and ended up falling the rest of the way. And you can see my quarry went down into my mining shaft over there, but um, no big deal on that. Um, hopefully today we'll do a little bit more on the sand castle. Get that up and up and running, and then uh, yeah, you can see it right there at the bottom right of my map, bottom right-ish huge huge area I'd like to get the second tree farm up and running and then um, possibly get to work on um, I don't even know what I don't even know what we will work on probably getting uh, ready to set up the biodiesel biogas engines or whatever they are most of the top here um, I did did happen to read that the the bio gas engines that I normally use do not use um, do not use the uh, biogas that is created in a refinery so but I can use that in uh, combustion engines. So we'll mess around with that and see what what we come up with. Looks like there's, looks like there's a cave system down there I'd like to go and eventually explore. Because I would like to see if I could find melons. <clears throat> but let's see if we can't get... Um, some biogas engines up and running. I'd like to do, or at least, yeah, get a the biogas uh, refinery thing up and running, so that can start to get warmed up and firing off. Um, let me bring that up real quick. I'm just gonna put this. Oops. Uh, I do need to move all of this, and the plan is to set up a giant reactor, most likely, that will, I got a ton, ridiculous amount of lava, so maybe I'll just use this. I do need to get to the MFE and MFSU stage, so, uh, but first, we're going to, we're going to convert to biogas, so let me bring up that recipe, get the stuff I need, be right back. Okay, and, and as you can see, I was messing around with some... Uh, not really mods, I just modified this texture. Um, problem is this is g ridiculously tiny, but uh, I got a little one-up mushroom there. I was just messing around. Let's see what I could create. Let's get rid of that guy, that guy. And these, for the heck of it. Burn those up. And these are not doing anything except for generating energy. Okay, so... What I need to make is a fermenter. Um, to do that, I'm going to make two of them. Um, because they do use electricity. I'm probably going to end up taking this over there. Because I'm going to set it up in the new house. But I need uh, bronze gears. So we'll make some more bronze just so we can have that. I did make one biogas engine before. Uh, let's get some gears going. Need four per uh, per fermenter. Yeah, that's good. 
Oh, I needed some of this. Bam. Okay, and then from there... Uh, it's not going to be enough. I need to make some more. I need to make sturdy machines too, so... I need to make some more. Bronze gears. Bam. Okay. Oops. I'm going to be one short. Can't count. And these are going to sit and make... Um, probably only need one at first. These are going to make... glass. These are going to make my uh, fuel that I'm going to need. Get that burned up real quick. And I might as well grab a full stack or so. Because I'm going to need I'm going to need a bunch of tanks. So we got one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Oops. Definitely made one too many gears, which is... Oh, no. There we go. Two fermenters. Bam! Let's get some glass. Alright, I'm going to let that finish out. And then make it daytime, and I'll be right back. Okay, got a ton of glass. Which is good. I'll let this finish out. Okay. We're going to make... We don't need this many. 16 of them? Uh, do we want 16 of them? We'll make 16 of them. Probably had some here too. Yeah, six more. Okay. Not a big deal. But, um, I need torches. I would like to make more of those. But I'm going to take these and make glowstone blocks. Put him in my house. Let's head over to the house. Weeds have taken over that little patch, but that's okay. We're going to be moving on. I need to expand my rubber farm before I even think about setting up um, more industrial craft stuff. I need a ton of rubber. What is that? It's ridiculous. I'm trying to get him out of there so I don't have an issue. There we go. See, this is why I brought the glowstone blocks. Which I will not use here. Only because... I'm going to end up putting... Um, the redstone power writing lighting in there. I have to fix that. I forgot about that guy. Okay. What we got here? That's a decent amount of stuff. Uh, we'll take half of you. Oh, I forgot. Um, forgot to get fertilizer. So I'm going to need fertilizer and I'm going to need water. <laughs> Fertilizer and water. Alright, let me grab... I'm going to make an infinite water source and have it pump into these. So, let me go get that set up. I'll be right back. Okay, I think I have everything... I think I have everything that I need. Chances are I don't, but... I have enough to get this going. I'm going to make even in water over here on the back side. I'll probably end up covering this in with something just so it's not exposed to possible creeper explosions, stuff like that. This 
Let me get this going. Get the pump set up. And we'll go like use the sandstone just because. Pump. Um, redstone engines. Done this a million times. Did I just hear? I think I just heard. Thought I just heard a skeleton bones. Get that going. Get that going. Gold transport pipe. Bring him up here. Okay. Way too much. Let's get some glowstone up here so we don't have any issues. Just gonna set these down like this for the time being. They will be most likely 100% moved. Put you there. <coughs> Green zombies already. Electricity is flowing. It's going to be severely hampered, but. Okay, piping. These guys are going to go. I got to remember not to do what I did last time and hook up two different types to a teleport pipe and ruin my game. So these guys are going to need water and electricity. So we're going to go like this. Like that. I'm actually gonna bring you guys in one more. So there's a only one hole coming in the wall. Okay. So you're gonna come in. So you're getting pumped up. You're coming in the wall, and you're going boom. Boom, boom. Right? I'll pump you out the bottom, I think. Oh, I didn't make more redstone engines, but that's okay. Electricity. This is going to get converted to electricity. <clears throat> which I'm not sure what the frequency is. 100. <laughs> yeah, we're going to pump out the bottom. But we're going to go like this. For electricity. Hopefully you're not attached. There. Yeah. 100. Connect it up. That's nice. Nice looking, right? Uh, electricity is there. Let's just test this out. And we'll put fertilizer. We're going to have to set up some sort of system to make sure those are constantly being filled up. And that's working. What we're going to do is I'd like to pipe you into the same one. It's not going to work. 
So actually, whoa! I don't know how that happened. Thought I had enough light up here. Maybe I don't. Okay. Do need to get some more sand though. That's going. I'm trying to think where I want this stuff. I want to pipe it into the same one. It's just so I can convert from there. Yeah, see those are going now. Good, good, good. Awesome. So this guy will be going. Refill you with some hummus. I'm just gonna take you. But now, if you, if you look, it's severely draining my electricity. I think it, that almost killed it completely. So we know you're working. So we're just gonna turn you off for now, so that this can continue. We'll have to get more going because we need saplings to convert. If the saplings don't convert, then there's no point in having any of this. All right, um, tanks, tanks, tanks. <laughs> Maybe we'll put all the tanks along that side. Yeah, we'll go like this for now because he's gonna have to be pumped out. That seems like good height. Those will be the main tanks for this stuff. And we'll split this up. Get you guys in there. False. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So that's set up. That guy's going. Monsters everywhere. Electricity's flowing here. Right? Yep. Trees are growing. Alright. Um <clears throat> The next thing is probably let's we gotta get back in the house. Let me fight my way back in the house and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back in the house. And we did happen upon some more tungsten. And some emeralds. So what I'm going to do to end this episode. These are full and good. Yep. Okay. I do need I do need to get some more uh, or at least some uh, chunk loaders so, and I have forgotten to look it up once again. So if anybody does know that, uh, that would be helpful if you could just pass that information along to me. But uh, let me bring up what we're gonna do is we are going to Probably should get that out of there. I don't know if it's going to kill the energy from the client star. I would like to make a, a bigger client star and then attempt to upgrade one of these guys. So, let me bring up that recipe and I'll, we'll get to work on that to finish out this episode. Okay, so, first off, to get to the next level of um, collector, I'm going to need uh, one piece of dark matter. And to get the next Klein Star, I'm going to need two more Klein Star Eines, which are a diamond surrounded by. Uh, I thought I had some stuff in here. A couple diamonds. That. Let's, uh, let's move some of this stuff out of here that I don't need right now. Yeah, that's good for now. Boom. Boom, boom. Okay. All right, so, um, red manor, so, gonna need, how many of these can I get? One, two, three, four? Wow, okay, sweet. Okay, so this is the clan star iron. Boom. And I need four of those, which I 
I can quickly make. Like that. Now I don't know if using these will kill the energy that's in there, so I want to use up the energy first. So the Clan Star Iron is done. I need diamonds surrounded by Eternus fuel. I'm going to need four more of these. One, two, three, four. And I'm going to need nine diamonds, which I'm not going to get out of that. Probably not going to get out of this either. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see if I can combine these. Not enough. So we're going to... Yeah, the next level energy collector is definitely what I need. Just kind of contemplating my options here. It'll help me get stuff faster. So, those two are dead. So, we're going to see if it saves its energy. Uh, actually, to make sure, we'll go like this. Uh, burn up. How do I transfer back? No. Uh, Oh well. No big deal. The Clan Star is five. We'll move over to him. Let's see if he kept whatever energy was there. Uh, I guess it did. That's good. I need one more diamond, which is not there. So, put him there. Suck up what's in there. That might actually give me it, but we're going to burn off. Uh, couple of those emeralds. Fill him up a little bit. And we'll get one more diamond out of him. So. Actually, I was looking at the... No, I was looking at the right one. Okay, so. Make a diamond block. And surround him. The turn of fuel gives me dark matter. Now, if I go to the energy collector, I'm going to need you. And I'm gonna need s probably don't need more glowstone. I have five, I think. I need five more. Yeah, that's pretty good. 